but it's also realistic. Like, you know, here's a little sneak peek. I'm spontaneously making this video. Wait, do I have something in my teeth? <laughs> So these are meals that are on a budget. <laughs> Hello my beautiful people. I am spontaneously making this video. Hold on. <coughs> Hear that sizzle? That's my thing. So these are meals that are on a budget. <laughs> Most importantly. I try to keep them as healthy as I can, but it's also realistic. Like, you know, sometimes I have like a little bit of Nutella and bread, like. And I just want to show y'all what I eat, because especially if you're vegan, it's a little hard to do it in Paris. Um, and even if you're not in Paris or anything, like, I'm also just gonna be sharing some good tips on how to make your food last, but also make sure that you get enough food, you get enough nutritious food, and all the beautiful goodness that comes with the joy of eating. So come along, come along. Let me show you what I got cooking right now. Honestly, chickpeas are my savior right now. I'm not really stirring this too much though because I'm trying to let the carrots cook and marinate and everything. This type of meal is such a good base point because I can have it with spaghetti and like noodles i could have it with bread there's so many different ways to put this meal together which is why it's such a good starter point just to have for meal prepping but also just like to be creative with it it leaves you space to be creative and make it in different ways which is good for if you're trying to make sure that you save your food <laughs> and kind of like elongate your time with it so you don't have to go buy out like buy too much don't store like your canned goods this is so loud sorry about it you don't store your canned goods like this in the fridge because I don't know specifics I forgot it long story short air can something about things coming up point is not healthy it can cause cancer so make sure that you empty out your canned goods into a different container and then put it in the fridge I don't know specifics so like look that up also, I might be wrong, but it's better to be safe than sorry. So here is my beautiful creation. And this is a lot of food, right? A tip that I want to give is honestly just make a shit ton of fucking food so that you don't, you're basically meal prepping. You don't have to think about it throughout the week because this is easy to heat up. This will last me like maybe three to four meals, which is amazing. And it's jam packed with protein, veggies, like carbs, corn for energy. Mm. That tastes delicious. Also, while I cook, I try to minimize dishes as much as freaking possible, man. I reuse stuff. I literally have only been... Also, I only have a butter knife here in Paris. <laughs> so, I'm making do of what I can. The only dishes I really need to clean after this meal is this, that, and that. And I'm only eating with a plate now, just for the ease of filming, but I normally wouldn't even eat it with a plate because a girl doesn't like to do dishes. Sue me. Dinner sucks. This is what one looks like. I normally have two, so I'm gonna have another one after this, but. We got my filling all jam packed in this gorgeous gorgeous thing i love it because it gives me the protein from the chickpeas oh, i'm spilling it a tip that i want to give you if you're trying to make sure that you get your vegetables in because sometimes sometimes i'm like girl i just want to have ramen and not think about my vegetables if we're being realistic here is i try to make kind of like my veggies my snack whether it's eating just a I love carrots, they're so easy to eat. You can have multiple a day, it's a great snack. And then also just plain mushrooms. I know some people don't like raw mushrooms, but 
I love it. But enough yap them. Let's try this. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm coming in with the tips today, but another tip that I want to share is swap out like butter or really any other oil for olive oil if you can. Olive oil is really good for you. It's a really healthy fat. Another tip if you're trying to make yummy, delicious meals on a budget, invest in spices, invest in like flavors, There's onion, garlic. Those are going to make your dishes delicious. I normally would have hot sauce with it, but I'm trying to save that for raw You pick and choose, you pick and choose what you can do. Mm, one final tip today. Make sure you actually do research on what is healthy for you. Like what vegetables are healthy for you. Because I feel like a lot of people think corn is a vegetable. But corn doesn't really do anything except like give you energy. It's kind of more considered a carb. At least as far as I know. But it gives you energy. There's nothing wrong with carbs. That shit is healthy for you. That shit is good for you. Hi, beautifuls. Wait, do I have something in my teeth? Wait, hold on. I have a few more tips, but. I have a few more tips that I'm gonna give y'all. First of which, I just reached the end of my meal and I was like, damn, I'm still like a little hungry, but like not really. It's not like I wanna make a whole new meal. Drink some water. Drink some water if you're like that because chances are you probably just need more water and hydration. So that's also just a beautiful thing to have with your food is just make sure you drink that water. But also, it makes you feel satiated and full if you can feel that way beforehand. So drink some water with your food. The other tip I wanna give, this one is about being resourceful. So I'm obviously in Paris right now. I'm in an Airbnb for a few months and I don't really have like storage to like store food and if you're kind of in a situation or you just don't want to buy tableware i'm just reusing glasses that food came with so oh my god look at that it's almost a whole entire jar of food yes i love that Okay, so I did plan to eat some of these mushrooms raw. Here's the thing, they're good to eat. They're good to eat, but they're like not as fresh and that will just like fuck with me. But they're still good and I don't want to waste them. So honestly, I'm going to cut them up, saute them, and then just add them to what I made yesterday so that we can still save them and I don't want them to be like rotting in the fridge. So this is how I'm being resourceful with these. You can either have like honey with oats, brown sugar. I actually, it's probably my favorite way to have it. But I am not, as I don't have a sweet tooth. I like the salty unami flavors. So if you haven't tried savory oats, put some salt on that. Salt and butter, just giving you an idea that you might have not thought of before. Oh my god. Also, drink that water. Make sure you drink water. Honestly, I've been kind of forgetting. Not really. I've been drinking like water in the day, but I used to drink a lot more water than I do. So this is also a reminder for me. It's also good just to have it in the morning. I don't know where all of my knives went. So I'm gonna try to cut these with a fork. Bear with me. Peanut butter is also a really good source of protein as well. So I'm getting my protein in in the morning.
I'm eating one of my favorite dinners and it's so simple. It is this super yummy, look, I know that that pasta looks like it doesn't have any flavor, but it's completely drenched in this yummy kind of teriyaki sauce with some soy sauce as well. And then I've obviously been eating my tofu, but it's just a good protein, carb, mix and again very simple to eat i'm actually out of vegetables which is ridiculous so i always make sure that i have like a multivitamin at least obviously every single day but on days when i'm out of vegetables because my artichoke carts went bad i love to munch on those by themselves i like to make sure that i have multivitamins because i want to make sure that i'm still like intaking things <laughs> hi wait let me do my teeth also, ignore whatever this is. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie. It's been a while since I really posted about what I'm, not posted, like captured what I'm eating. So I'm gonna give y'all a bit of an update. To be honest, it's pretty much the same. It's just another variation of carbs, veggies, like chickpeas and kind of like that whole ordeal. But I wanna show what I'm eating right now. So come along, come along. Oh, also, I got a light. I'm not gonna show you. It's blinding. I'll tell you that much. Okay, one second. I just meal prepped some chickpeas and Sam and I, we found this like vegetable soup. So I just feel like I already had some food. I'm just reusing the pan that I used beforehand. But I just feel like this is a really good like filler and also it helps me feel like better about making sure I intake my vegetables. Another thing that I eat, which is kind of weird and I'm not sure if I documented it. So if I didn't, here we go. And it's what I just ate. It's like macaroni noodles with like a, like a spoonful of hummus and olive oil and any sort of like spices, whether I want like garlic or salt or pepper or whatever and then soy sauce and then I mix it around and I just make kind of like a hummus soy sauce sauce for my macaroni noodles look I know it sounds kind of weird but it slaps like it's the perfect balance between like <sighs> look I'm just telling you it's delicious okay and you have to trust me on it. And it's a really easy meal as well. And I kind of just made it up by myself and that's on being resourceful. That's on using what you have. I'm reusing this container that I literally had chocolates in it. Sam gave me like chocolate and I this was the container that the chocolate was in. Shout out to Farashere, you're literally the best chocolate on the planet. Um, just keep the basics and keeping it resourceful. You can make up a lot of different dishes with everything. Also hummus, underrated. Also, why is it coming in such small tubes? What the fuck, guys? Anyway, please support me by subscribing. And if you wanna see all my other Paris content, I honestly had so much fun making my art here. So please support me as well by checking that out. If you feel so inclined, um, that was weird. What the fuck, am I a fedora man? Okay.